Hey folks, this is Theo Novice. I'm just entering uh, the Mattis atmosphere here in my ugly ship. And now I'm in the atmosphere. And I'm just going to land here. Uh, this ship floats very easy. Notice that uh, if I hit the brakes, it's got good brakes. It'll actually hover in the air pretty much. It doesn't fall too fast. Slowing down significantly, so it's got real great brake force. Look at that! I'm, I'm, I came to a standstill in the air. So I like having things with lots of wings and lots of brakes because if all else fails, I can still land safely. Mattis only has about half gravity, so that helps too. Uh, so what I've got is uh, uh, let me actually turn off the. Uh, Turn the sound down. I always forget that, don't I? Uh, just gonna land here. Uh, I'm six kilometers up, six and a half roughly, and I'm just gonna land here. And in my uh, cargo hold, I have a territory scanner. All right, so gonna start scanning here, looking for some uh, ore. I scanned a little bit on one of the Haven moons and I didn't find much. This one had coal, this one had quartz. If you wanted a real good quartz tile, if, that would be good. That one has uh, coal and quartz, coal and quartz, uh, coal and quartz, and coal and quartz. So those are different tiles on the Alley Alpha Moon 1 that I scanned. Not anything that I'm looking for right now, though. So what I'm looking for right now is uh, chromite and pyrite. Okay, we got plenty of the tier ones. Looking for the tier two, tier three. Pyrite is going to be important for warp cell production. It's one of you pretty much got to have all the tier threes, but uh, definitely pyrite. Uh, but we need chromite too. Now I can surface mine chromite and limestone here on Mattis, but uh, I do not plan on doing that. So the best way to do this would be to get an anti-gravity ship and actually hover uh, above the ground and scan from in the air. Uh, this ship does not have that. It doesn't, it doesn't even have uh, vertical boosters. It has uh, hovers on it. So it has a lot of uh, parts that came with the ships. Notice I'm landing very carefully here. I just hit G to break land and it's coming down nice and easy. Uh, if all else fails and you don't know how to land carefully, just hit G if you've got arch head on and brake land. And there we have it. We're down. Okay, so we're on the edge of a tile here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to scan the tile I just happened to land on because I guess any one is as good as another right now. Uh, let me go into build mode so I can get up out of here. Uh, actually, I need build mode on anyway. Uh, I'm going to put the scanner up on top of the ship. I could put it up on a separate core outside, but I'm just going to set it up right here in the middle. Because I should be able to fly. If I put it kind of center of gravity, I should be able to fly to... That should work. Alright. should be able to fly to different places with it on the top, and it should should work fine. Uh, Alright, so what we're going to do is this takes 15 minutes to scan. We're just going to activate it. And it'll go through and do its thing. Alright, so we'll come back when it's 15% uh, and show you that. Uh, in the meantime, I'm connected to my ship container. Uh, and when we get done, we'll have a scan that looks something like this. Right? It'll tell us what's, it'll actually tell us what's there and then we get to choose to save the scan. I always save my scans. Scans are like blueprints. They don't really take up any any weight. They just take up a slot, not not anything else. So you can put them in an extra small container and they're just fine. They don't take up any volume, so to speak. Uh, so uh, I brought, I, I did produce uh, some of my own fuel out of my nano pack because uh, I didn't have enough. Uh, so I actually need to fill up the ship here sometime soon. But what I'm going to do while I'm uh, waiting for that is I'm going to do some surface mining of Tier 2. And uh, on Mattis you'll see we've got two different kinds of ore. You've got chromite and you've got limestone. Let's go find a, uh, another 
ore pocket around here, surface ore. Should be one somewhere here. And we've actually sent people over here and come back with lots and lots of ore. But uh, there's only going to be a very little tier 2. Like in each pile of rocks, you get all the tier 1s, but then you get a little bit of tier 2. So you've got the chromium rocks here. Right? So you've got the chromite I'm picking up. And then you've got the limestone. Okay? So that's all I'm looking for. I would not... I don't think it's worth the fuel for me to go to Mattis or any other planet and bring back tier one unless I have like lots of miners set up and that's just what I'm doing but to me it's it's not worth the effort so let me mark my ship Let's see here where am I okay that's right here I don't have that ship loaded in as a construct for me. It's a construct for the organization, and I am not a legate, so I can't see it. So I have to mark it. All right. There we go. Got my tier two there, and off to the next one. So you can come to Mattis. You can go to Alioth, and you can get uh, uh, malachite, which is copper, and you can get limestone there too. So. Uh, we've been, I've actually made several trips over there to get copper too, so uh, I usually get both, you might as well get both tier twos while you're there. And we've got quite a bit of limestone because you get limestone here too. So uh, what we're doing right now is trying to get some my scanning done so we can put some miners down to actually mine uh, all of the ores that we, that we want to have. Yep, see, it's got it all stuck in here with the tier one ore. You got to kind of go around it. Uh, so let's look at uh, some of the different planets, and we'll we'll talk about ore real quick here. All right. So if I go to my map, and I start looking here at the system. Let's look at Thades. I just showed you what's on here. So on Thades we have malachite and garnerite. So if I want to, I, I can surface mine malachite on Alioth, but in order to get it out of the ground, I have to go to Thades, right? Now, if I look at Alioth, Alioth in the ground has limestone and acanthite, which is another tier three, tier two, tier three. Uh, so let's real quickly look at uh, Thades again. Thades had malachite and garnerite, which garnerite's the tier three. And Mattis, where I am now. Not trying to click myself. Stop that. All right. Well, anyway, that's what we do. All right. Mattis has chromite and pyrite. So that's not all the ores, though. How do I find the rest of the ores? Well, Unfortunately, right now, we only got so many planets. Uh, you can go to Tioma, and Tioma has uh, Petalite, Natron, which is another Tier 2, and Cryolite. All right? So you've got uh, some higher tier ores there uh, that you can go get. Uh, if you go to Jago, which is a water planet, and by the way, to go to the Tioma and Jacko, you got to go through PvP space. Okay. So again, more Akinthite, uh, which you can also find on Alioth, I believe, and Cobaltite and Illuminite. Well, Illuminite is the tier five, right? So tier four, tier five. So uh, what else can I find? Let's take a look here. Let's let's see if we can. Zoom in on Jago. Well, we zoomed in on Mattis. I hate this map, how it's set up. <laughs> Let's try to get Jago in my sight. There's Tioma. 
we got it on the side of us. Let's try that one. I wish they had fixed their map. This is really tough. It used to be a lot easier to find the moons and planets, but now it's very hard. Whoa. All right. Well, I'll just give you an example here with uh, Mattis, for example. So if I look at the system here, and I zoom into it, you see that we've got the moons. On moon one of Mattis, I have Natron and Actinthite. Right? And then I have Malachite and Petalite on Moon 2. And on Moon 3, I'm not talking about Tier 1, so I've got Chromite and Garnerite. So uh, there's also the moons around Alioth, but the problem is the moons have very little ore. So going to the planet is uh, going to be a, your only good option there for, uh, for some of the things that we've got. I'm going to try to see if I can zoom in on some of these other planets. Let me zoom out. Let's see if I can get Jago to come up here. Just trying to see if it had any moons. Good lord. Alright. Well, let's do this. To view the planet, view on system map. There it goes. That works. Now I should be able to zoom in, hopefully. And I don't see any moons at all on that one. Let's try Tioma. Again, I don't see any moons around Tioma. So, what you see is what you get. Uh, as far as the the system goes, I mean, it's uh, literally the moon of Thades, the moons of Mattis, and the moons of Alioth, the planets themselves, and then the other two planets. That's all you get. So, there's more planets that are supposed to be out there that they haven't put back into the game yet that used to be there in beta that they're going to add in eventually. So uh, when you're looking for ore, that's how you go about it. All right, so let's uh, head back kind of a roundabout way to the ship, and we'll see if uh, we've gotten any uh, scan results yet. I don't think it's been 15 minutes, but we can try to take a look and see. Just kind of wanted to give you guys a, a, a little overview of the ore and where it's at and it kind of lays it out. Uh, I, I don't like the way the map is working right now. I'm really kind of irritated with it. It was a lot easier before. Uh, maybe there's a better way to work the map that I don't understand and I'm just doing it the wrong way, trying to manu manually flip through it. So, but that could be too. I'm not the... Uh, brightest player out there when it comes to the game mechanics and the controls so a lot of the people I, I play the game with are much better at that stuff alright so we're just picking up some more ore and I haven't picked up very much but you know I've also got I've almost got a half a kiloliter of both well getting on towards a half a kiloliter uh, of both last time I left here I had uh, I think two kiloliters, or, or I'm sorry, 20 kiloliters of each. So we got quite a bit last time, and the last time a big group came over, they brought back a whole lot. Uh, of course, uh, our group pitched in all our money, and we bought one of the anti-gravity generator ships. So we're actually using that one right now to do some scans on another planet. And uh, I'm just over here in my little crappy ship with this scanner. Uh, we've only got two scanners out so far, so we're going to uh, have to work on uh, getting some more. It takes about 21 hours, I think, to kick one off, even with everything going on. So this is at 73%. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and uh, spend a couple of moments productively after I get back down on the ground here. 
uh, refueling my ship. Uh, I may have to go buy some space fuel because I had some shenanigans coming here that uh, kind of messed things up and now I don't have a lot of fuel. So I have to go back slow or I have to go to the market and buy some. I don't know what I'll do. We'll see. Uh, but the good thing about Atmo fuel, and I need Atmo fuel to run around and scan all the different tiles, is I can make that in my nano pack. Uh, and I still have a couple hundred liters, but I can I can get more coal and quartz. Uh, whoops, let's see here. I can get more coal and quartz and produce more fuel, which I actually have some producing right now. Uh, so that's one good thing about uh, your nano pack is you can make your fuel in it. You just have to get your quartz and your coal and when you produce your pure silicon and your pure carbon you get these two as byproducts right and that will give you the four components that you need to make your nitron uh, atmospheric fuel and you're good to go now i'm not going to be able to make any more after this unless i go get some more ore off the ground which i can do uh, but we'll uh kind of let that take its own time all right so let me go into build mode so that I can get up on top of here so let's check this one more time and I'm gonna go ahead and pause the video at this point and I'll come back on when we're at 99% and we'll pick it back up 